Okay, I'm participating in the challenge put out by Jessica on how to ADHD here on YouTube in her video. Why do we hold ourselves to neurotypical standards? So the question, and by the way, Jessica, if you happen to hear this, um, watch this or any of it, I just, I love your channel. Um, I am a person that was diagnosed with ADHD before getting diagnosed with bipolar disorder and well, the bipolar disorder seems to be under control most of the time. I seem to have a lot of the issues with ADHD symptoms. Anyway, geez, there I go already. The challenge is to talk about what I'm good at. So I will also extend the challenge to my viewers of which I have a much smaller following than how to ADHD uh, and that is okay. Um, she does such a great job editing and um, assembling and scripting. Uh, so, okay, here goes nothing. Um, what I am good at, I'm definitely good at divergent thinking. And thank you for teaching me that phrase because that helped me to feel a little bit better. Um, I have been doing a class, a workshop sort of thing all week, and it's been really amazing. And uh, most of us are not neurotypical. And nonetheless, I still stand out a lot for my, what I now know is called divergent thinking or the ability to basically brainstorm almost an endless number of ideas, connections, and so forth as opposed to convergent thinking, which is, of course, narrowing those things down, maybe even deciding how to categorize them. So, yeah, but, man, divergent thinking for the win. Um, I'm pretty good at speaking off the cuff. I'm definitely good at not caring that much what people think, which doesn't mean that I don't care. I definitely do, and I definitely get self-conscious, but I... Um, I do it anyway most of the time like I put these videos out without scripting them <laughs> or editing them um, so I want to say that in a lot of ways I am good at getting over my uh, sort of innate perfectionism I'm usually pretty good at that uh, what else am I good at? I am actually good at putting together a flowery turn of phrase. I want to work on being more succinct, but that was just something that Jessica on How To AD, she said that is a skill, definitely, to be able to just say things simply. I am good at understanding science. I am, I am very good at logic, it turns out. I aced my logic class like... It was just logical. Um, I was surprised when when it didn't come easily to other people because it actually seemed just logical. So I'm good at geometry proofs too. Um, I am good at persuading people. I am good at making people feel understood. I'm good at empathy um, and compassion. And um, I'm good at languages, foreign languages. I'm pretty good at those. Um, fairly good uh, dancer definitely not the greatest <laughs> um, definitely not the most flexible or uh, the best technique look at see I can't even just put a compliment in without like a qualifier like oh I gotta be balanced I am good at seeing multiple sides of a thing I am good at doing pros and cons and seeing the other side and even um, like mediating a debate um, I'm good at hearing feedback um, and being open to to hearing that even when it's critical I'm good at crying in front of people uh, I don't know if that's something that I wanted to do but I just at some point along my life just was like you know what that happens and 
some people it happens a lot and I'm just not gonna get all bent out of shape about it um, I'm good at taking my medications as um, as prescribed and as scheduled um, I'm good at this is a funny one I'm good at sorting things in rainbow order <laughs> I'm actually really good at folding things, sort of Marie Kondo style, which I totally did way before I knew about her or she put any of her books out, just for the record. Um, I made that up myself, so I'm good at that. Do I do it all the time? No. Um, only when I feel like I want to spend the time to do it. Um, I'm good at creating systems of order sort of I have to really really think it through so maybe that's not I I like to try to do it anyway I'm good at coloring things <laughs> like mandalas and um, I'm good at swimming butterfly not compared to an Olympic swimmer um but better than your average bear um and so my brain is going through the things i came up with a lot of things my brain is coming through with all the things that i'm not good at i am good at making people laugh and shocking people <laughs> with silly irreverent things to say I am good at surprising people, at looking a certain way based on my mood or whatever. I, I'm good at dressing up to put on a, a certain character. And I enjoy, I think I always used to enjoy doing that and then watching people slowly be taken aback when they see that I'm a complex person that doesn't really neatly fit in a category. And I'm really good at speaking out um, about things that I believe in. I'm good at asking questions. Yeah, my classmates used to tell me that. You ask really good questions. Like, I wouldn't have thought to even ask that. Um, and uh, insightful questions. I'm, so I'm good at uh, helping to advance along a class discussion. And as much as I definitely go on and on, and I'm very good at always having some damn thing to say, um, and I'm pretty skilled in the uh, beautiful art of cursing. <laughs> uh, um, I'm also pretty good at summarizing a point. It might not be the most concise, and I definitely can summarize it. And I'm good at writing emails, apparently. And, uh, and I'm good at being silly. Uh, and I'm pretty decent at doing my makeup and picking out clothes. So, yeah, and oh, I am so good at standing on my head and hula hooping. Like, I could do both of those things all day. So, um, oh, and I'm also really good, it turns out, at growing babies. <laughs> really, really, really healthy, organic baby. And, and fostering such a comfortable, soothing, womb environment that the baby just doesn't ever want to come out <laughs> so um yeah so i think that is gonna be it and i hope it made you smile and uh i'm feeling really good about myself right now so i'm gonna try to keep that up and this was an unexpected topic for today so again thank you i'm gonna put a link below to the video that inspired this and if you haven't ever checked out the how to ADHD channel I totally recommend it I uh, you know 
call this channel bipolar brilliance because I really do believe that life with bipolar disorder, even though it is considered a severe mental illness and definitely can be disabling, it was disabling to me at one point in time. Um, I also believe that if in my particular case, I, it's my belief that it is a blessing in disguise because it gives me the richness of feeling a brilliant array, if you will, a spectrum of experiences that, and, and also a really precise, sensitive feedback mechanism that when I listen to that brain body feedback and keep myself in balance, I really can can thrive and and can probably achieve things that other normies might not be able to so you know I am definitely still exploring all of these facets of my identity because it's just I don't want to say it's a balancing act between like just accepting diagnoses and and like when you get them questioned or like you you change circumstances like say being in recovery from substance use disorder and you start to question I got all these letters which ones are actually accurate and anyway whatever if the shoe fits so point being my bipolar experience isn't gonna look like yours and theirs um, because we're all different um, and that's also why I think of it as a spectrum it um, You know much like the autism spectrum. So that is another reason that I like my term bipolar brilliance. So um, Also definitely have ADHD and a few other letters. So that's definitely enough unscriptedness um, my little uh, Ramble tangent wouldn't be a wouldn't be a video without a rosy ramble tangent. So Thank you. If you made it to the end, give yourself a pat on the back and I challenge you to share in writing or on your social media or written on a napkin what it is that you are good at because you are good at a lot of things. All right. Till next time, take care of yourself and be kind to each other.